Fiat Tipo. Expected launch, October 2016. Expected price, rupees 8 to 13 lakh. Fiat will replace the aging Linea sedan next year. Its successor is likely to be this new machine called the Egea, a premium C-segment sedan which was shown as the Egea concept car earlier this year and has now been christened the Egea. Globally it replaces the Bravo and has already been put into production at Fiat's plant in Turkey for a majority of LHD markets. Exterior Fiat's have always been known to make good-looking cars and this one, the Egea seems to be no less. The front is dominated by a new in-your-face chrome grille which has the familiar Fiat logo right in the middle. The bonnet gets some muscular bulges while the headlamps are shaped like thin battle axes and add quite a bit to the face of the car. Move over to the side and you can see the familiar Fiat sedan lines thanks to the strong shoulder line and softly flared wheel arches. At the rear we can see the wraparound tail lamps and chrome strip above the number plate slot. Interior The cabin seems to be more of an updated affair rather than a completely new design. It includes elements like a completely new instrument cluster, infotainment system and climate control with physical knobs. Given its size and length, we expect that it will be quite spacious at the rear and will be sold with accessories like rear AC vents, 12 volts socket, sunshades and armrest with storage space. There is also a possibility that a screen may be included as an optional extra. Engine and Gearbox On the engine front, the Egea will be offered with four engines two petrol and two diesels. The former is expected to include the 1.4-liter twine air and most likely the 1.4-liter jet petrol for markets like India. On the diesel front, the engines are expected to be the 1.3-liter multijet as well as a 1.6-liter multijet. Transmission options are expected to include a 6-speed mount as well as a 6-speed at competition. Expect an India launch for the EGA during this time next year though we suspect that it will have a different name. It will be their C-segment competitor and will replace the current Linea which is then expected to replace the Linea Classic as has been the case with the current cars. It will be priced in the current cars bracket and compete with vehicles like the Honda City, Nissan Sunny, Maruti Suzuki Jazz, Hyundai Verna and the Renault Scala.